Hi guys, Top Pops here, and today we're going pop hunting again. Today we're going over to, you ready for this one? Toys R Us, which is not open in the States anymore, but I hear they're opening it up as TRU or something like that. Um, like TRU Kids, I think it's something. I'm not really sure, but I know they're gonna be reopening it, like putting all of their brands together. Um, but right now we're going over to Toys R Us. I think there's Chapters nearby, which is kind of like a Barnes & Noble in Canada. They have a couple pops, as well as EB Games. So anyways guys, let's get started. Okay guys, we made it to Toys R Us. Okay guys, so we made it over to the pop section here and they have a bunch of random ones. Mom, they do have a vinyl pack up here. Yeah. They've got the Steve and Dustin. I know you already got it, but I thought it'd show it off. Uh, Spider-Man Noir. They do guys have a bunch of LeBron James, so we're gonna have to get one today. Awesome. This one's brand new, really neat. This is Dumbo one under there. Fireman Dumbo? Oh no, that's the Dreamland Dumbo. I already have that one. That one is, I saw this one. Uh, there's Fireman up there, but still, I'm pretty neat. The 11 and Dumbo. We have you don't 11. See that every day. No, you don't. This one we used to see at Target all the time, then someone must have bought them at our store. And we've got Rubius Hagrid, uh, Holiday Mickey, that's another really cool one. To, uh, Toys R Us seems to get a lot of random figures in that we don't get anywhere else. They've got Toothless, The Flash, Light Fury, uh, what else do we got over here? Prowler, Wasp, again LeBron James. This is the first time I've ever seen the LeBron James, so I'm getting this one for sure. Um, they do have Austin Powers up here and a bunch of the other Mickey ones. Now, if you look behind, guys, they're all kind of random. Like, here's the original Superman one. Um, what else do we got? Some random, like, Fortnite ones over here, Dark Voyager. Over here, guys, it is just all Fortnite stuff down here, but still pretty cool to see. Uh, do you see anything else, Mom? The Flash. Oh, yeah, The Flash. That's a nice one. That's a neat one. Spider-Man Noir. Uh, what else do we see? Anyways, looks pretty cool. They have a bunch of really good ones over here. Maybe I'll dig through them a bit because they don't seem to be the same all the way very through. Random. Yeah, very random. random. Especially with this LeBron James one. So I know I've said it a lot, but um, this is literally the first time I've ever seen this one. It's LeBron James and the pushing right next to each other. Um, so anyways, guys, we're gonna have to dig through these and see what else we can find. Guys, so we ran into the Thundercats vinyl. It's the, uh, what's this one? The New York Comic Con 2017 exclusive. They only have one of them. What's up with the box though? It's a little bad. That's not that bad, no, to be honest. Um, it's $30 though, but you don't see this one at all anymore. They also have some other stuff over here. Look, 4,000 pieces, Mom, for these guys. They've got the Rick and Morty ones over here. This one was exclusive to Walgreens in the States. I like this Now, one. this one here is, look, uh, this one in Canada is here. So Toys R Us, guys, gets a lot of exclusives that were in the States to right. Canada. They also have some mystery minis down there on sale. That's what Rye said he saw the other day. He didn't pick them up, but uh, Six mis um, some mystery minis over there. They also do have the uh, Bizarro mystery mini and then some other stuff over here. But yeah, Mom, personally, I think you should get that one because you're not going to see that one anywhere else in stores. Mm. It's a good one. It looks it's 30 bucks, it though. Looks it's really $30, cool. but it's a good one. I'm going to go price check it. Yeah, go do it. Okay guys, so we were gonna get this, but then my mom found it for $11, what was it, $11, $11. on Amazon? Yes. So uh, we're right. gonna skip on this today, we'll order this later though. Nice. Like um, we'll have to bring this back to the front, but I will be getting LeBron James. I checked the Hot Wheels cars to see if they had anything, they didn't, but uh, for now, this seems like we're about it for here, but Toys R Us, it's been fun. Okay guys, next up we made it to EB Game. Okay guys, so they actually redid their section back here, there's a bunch of really cool stuff. Um, they've got the Fallout ones over here, Game of Thrones, as you guys can see, they made it like thicker, so they're farther back it's like three out now um, they've got a bunch of cool stuff they've got red with doozer they've got orissa they've got a bunch of vinyl sets down there um they have the two gremlin ones that you like um what else do we got cam mitch gloria they've got roseanne rosanna dana boy meets world western morty agritsuko up here those ones are really neat um what else do we see over here we've got a bunch of really random new ones though they got ant-man they've got pink uh pink bunny down there We've got the new Toy Story ones over here, Disney. Gamer Mini, I've never seen in Canada yet, I don't think. Um, but that's neat. Yeah, Mrs. Nesbitt, I now have all of the Toy Story ones, so we're good to go there. Um, I do see Mom. Now this one, I don't know if this is the Chase or if this is the normal one. Yeah, it is. I don't know if this is the Chase or if this is the normal one. That's what I'm con very, very confused with, because the, the Chase one has the sticker on the normal one, if that makes sense. Um, but they do have Saw Cop, Betty Boop, and Pudgy over here. Yeah, what's that vinyl? Luke and Leia. You should see if they have any on sale like they did at the other store. They've got Abu. Um, we've got a bunch of random ones down there. Billy Idol is over there. Did we know these right were there. Bobbleheads? Yeah, the Star Wars ones are all bobbleheads. I think I knew that. I don't know if you knew that, though. Uh, we've got the Five Nights at Freddy ones here. Uh, Atom Bomb. This is such a nice pop, and I don't know. I never see this one anymore. My favorite, one of my favorite pops actually ever uh, right Jackson. here. Which one? The Jetsons? Where? The... Butch, Judy, and Oh, Alloy. yeah, yeah, yeah. Those are good. Oh, did you see this one back here too? 
uh, Baloo over there. They also have um, Negaduck back there, Lawyer Morty I saw. Uh, some from Voltron. Um, we've got the ones from Dragon Ball Z over here. Mega Man. No, you don't wear the. Oh, yeah, up here. Finn, Freddy Krueger, Sock Up Betty Boop, like, like that again. Uh, they've got Prince down here. Um, they have the Darth Vader and Stormtrooper uh, vinyl set down there. Yeah, yeah. I also noticed that they have the LA Kings Wayne Gretzky. This is one that you don't see very often. Uh, they've got Claude Goudreau, uh, William Carlson, Rick James. I did see Rick James. Where is he? I saw him. Oh, there he is, right there. Uh, but yeah guys, a bunch of really cool ones, so I'm gonna go over to some other sections and see what else I've got. Guys, here's the pop that I have, the Luke Skywalker one. I have the prototype for this. I got mine in the Fanatic of the Week prize. I might pick this up today so I can swap the boxes out. Do a bit of a swip swap on that one. And uh, we'll get this so I can put the prototype inside the normal box. Here is the Fortnite pop section. I just thought I'd show it off. They still have a lot of the Red Nose Raiders. Uh, pretty neat pop. And then they've got all the five star figures as well. And then some other stuff up as well. Okay guys, so I was gonna get it, but then I noticed guys on the back of the box that there's a giant cut on it. And usually it's like, I don't mind, but uh, because we're getting it just for the box, I'm not gonna be getting this one today. We'll find it some other time. Uh, but anyways guys, let's go to another store. Okay guys, so now we're over at Chapters. Let's see what's new. Here is the Chapters pop section. Uh, it doesn't look like too much is going on over here today. They're $10 for pops now, um, so that's cheaper. Um, but I don't see much. The, all they really have is the Royals and stuff like that. One time we found two chases here, but that was uh, kind of a special case. Yeah, normally they don't have much. Anyways, let's uh, let's shoot over to Walmart then. We are in Walmart now. I couldn't film at the front to show you, you know, the big Walmart sign, but I don't think you guys need it. You guys just want to see the pops. So let's run over there and see what's new. Here is the pop section over here. They do have some good ones actually. They've got some Superman. They've got the Workaholics ones. They've got Blake and I see Adam down here. And they have some of the Fortnite ones as well. Um, I did see that they have one vinyl set, and this is one that my mom's been looking for, and it's on sale for 14 instead of uh, 20 so maybe we'll pick that one up for her today, because she's over at uh, Chapters right now, so maybe I'll surprise her with that one. Um, but yeah, that seems to be about it for here and the cool stuff, so I think I'm going to go to the back, maybe they have, see if they have any Amiibos, um, but yeah, not too much special over here, but still, it's cool that we got this on sale. Yeah guys, no Amiibos. Alright guys, we're back from the store now, and I do have my Lego Movie uh, cup here. Everything is awesome. This is from the movie. Don't ask why. This is, uh, yeah, the McDonald's cup that came up. I don't know. I'm gonna say this right now. It's a really nice cup. It's kind of thick. And it doesn't really, it doesn't really wreck in the wash. Uh, we've had this for a couple years now, since like 2015, I think. Um, anyways, I just thought I'd mention it because we've got it. But, let's get into the two things that I got today. So first up, I'm trying to think of what we would have got first. Okay, so first up we would have got this. Um, now this is something that's really neat. I'm surprised they had it. I haven't seen this anywhere else, but it's a LeBron James Funko Pop. Um, and I might check this on uh, Stashpedia right now with the new updated app, see how that works. Um, scan the barcode, see what it looks like, because I didn't really know that LeBron James had a normal pop. I thought he just had the exclusive to Fanatics, and then the... Um, there was another one too coming to... Oh no, that was Michael Jordan. I'm not sure how many LeBron James ones there are. But if you guys don't know, with the new Stash PD app, if you click the camera in the corner, you can scan the barcodes. Um, it comes up on the thing, so it's actually really useful. Look, this is me. Hi. Um, but yeah, let's scan this. I think it's just a normal price pop, if I'm not mistaken. It's not even on here. Okay. So it might be like so new that they haven't even put it on the website yet. Because um, I think they're only up to Emerald City Comic Con for what they've got so far. Um, but yeah, very cool figure. I like the LeBron James one. I've been looking for this one for a while. I've been starting to get more NBA ones. I just got Lonzo Ball, um, which is also from the Lakers. So it's cool that I got both of them. One of them's an away jersey. One of them's a home jersey, though. Um, so you guys can see here. They're getting more detailed, which I really like about them. Does this one stand all right? Yeah, he stands pretty good. Um, they're getting more detailed with them, which I really like. As you guys can see, the basketball's got like little bumps on it and stuff like that now to kind of go with the ball. Um... It says James on the back in 23, and it's just got everything, it's pretty neat. I like the beard on him, it looks pretty good. It looks just like LeBron James. Um, I also like the shoes on him and everything like that. It does come with a base, which is nice in case he doesn't stand. Because of the way he's kind of leaning, like with the ball, it might be kind of hard to stand without the base, but uh, mine seems to stand all right without it. Um, so it'll be okay for a picture still. Uh, but anyways, guys, that's pretty neat. Super glad that I could get this one. And it was just such a random one to find over at Target, or Toys R Us, sorry. Um, so it's cool that I could get this one. Um, and there he is right there. Nice. Now, let's get into the next thing that I got. I only bought two things today. The second thing that I bought was um, something for my mom because she's into vinyls. If you guys don't know, 
She has an Instagram account called Top Vinyls. Um, you guys can check her out on uh, Instagram. It's the same way you spell the vinyls um, from Funko, V-Y-N-L. Um, so let's check this out right here, guys, because this is something that has been pretty cool, and it was on sale over at Walmart for 15 instead of 20 I mean, it's not much cheaper, but it is cheaper than EB Games sells them for, um, so I picked it up for her, and it is the Luke Skywalker and Princess Leia vinyl set. Um, now, if you guys don't know, this is they always come in two packs. They always have these like cool stylized giant heads, bodies. Um, I like them. I think they're great. If anything, guys, now I will say this. I think if Funko Pops were to go away, which I don't think they are, but if they do, vinyls would be up next. Um, they're just so cool and they're different, but they're similar at the same time. Um, if you guys know what I mean, they've got the big heads, the small bodies, the big eyes still. But they're more stylized to the actual character. Here's a back picture of them there, if you guys want to check that out as well. Um, so that's Luke and Leia there. I don't know. They're both very cool figures, um, and I love them a lot. I know um, Kibuki on Instagram, he's the one that designs all of them. And on there, you can actually find other vinyl sets that aren't released, or vinyl figures that he's designed, but they're not actually figures yet. They're just like concept arts that he's done, but they look real. Um, he's got a lot of really cool stuff on there. So anyways, I thought I would mention that just because... That these sets are designed by him and they're really neat. Uh, but anyways, guys, this is the Luke Skywalker and Princess Leia one. Next up, I need to get the Fortnite Rex and Tricera Ops one. The only reason I say that is because they're on sale at Walmart, so you're getting them cheaper than normal. I'm sure we can get them even cheaper later on, but for now, they're like 15 bucks. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys want to see more from me in the future, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, do all that. But this has been another episode of Top Pops Popsters. Thanks for watching.